Hey John Looty here again from workwithjohnlooty.com I've got another very short video for you today but before I start um, I'd like to say I hope you're getting some value from some of the free training videos uh, I've been doing lately um, that's why I do them so so um, I hope you you follow what I'm saying if you don't actually understand then obviously when you go to my blog which is whoisjohnlooty.com leave us a comment or leave us leave me some questions I will definitely get back to you um, anyway on with today's training and um, what I'd like to do to, in today's short video is just to show you how easy it is to set up a free almost free anyway squeeze page um, that you can immediately start to promote products with and drive traffic to to begin building your list okay I'm going to show you how to do that with Aweber today because that's the autoresponder service provider that I use. Um, I suggest that if you use somebody like GetResponse or maybe um, iContact, then they'll have something similar for you to use there. But today, the strategy I'm going to show you is the one that I use with Aweber. So with that, let's get on with it and we'll head on over to Clickbank first where we'll choose our product and then we'll begin the design of our simple squeeze page. Okay, thanks very much and I'll see you in a minute. Okay guys, here we are in Clickbank. Um, I'm in one of my Clickbank accounts that I use for training purposes. So uh, I'm just gonna quickly show you how to uh, find a product within Clickbank that you can promote easily by designing your own squeeze page with Aweber. Um, so let's get on with it. You can see what I'm in the marketplace already, but I'll show you if, if you go to your dashboard and click on marketplace, this is the page it takes you to. Okay, so let's find the product. Um, I'm in on the category list here. I'm going to click on the self help arrow there, going to scroll down again. Because uh, I, I like personal development, so I'm going to click on success and see where that takes me. Okay, again, I'm not going to go into the who, why's, and wherefores of how I choose a Clickbank product today. Uh, I've got plenty more training on that. This is the idea of this video is purely to show you how to find a product and use it and promote it via your squeeze page with the that you're going to design with Aweber so I'm going to look at this one here mine secrets exposed let's see what that's like I'm going to take this is going to take it to the sales page here's the sales page of sales page uh, mine secrets exposed let's pause the video let's scroll down okay now the beauty of doing this is that you don't need to reinvent the wheel okay you're going to take some elements of this sales page and you're going to use it within your squeeze page okay so you don't have to reinvent the wheel these people may well have spent thousands and thousands of pounds having these sales pages designed so you can utilize that and use it for your purposes that is your squeeze page okay so we've got the product uh, let's go back to the marketplace and we'll click promote okay that's the my account nickname for this particular account um, so let's see if we can create a tracking link or as Clickbank call them a hop link there we go I've created that hop link there so I'm going to copy that I'm going to open up a notepad and you can see here paste it in there okay so that's for use later let's save that and then we'll close the window okay just as a matter of interest just to double check that that um, hop link work let's open a new a new window on Google and we'll put it in there there's the hop link let's see what happens it take us to the same sales page yeah there it is so we know that that hop link works so that's good okay 
So now that we've got that, we can we can still keep keep the sales page open for 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 use later on. So we're going to head on over now. We're going to go back to Aweber. Okay, we're back on the sales page for Mind Seekers Exposed, um, and the reason for that is because I'm going to look for uh, a headline, which you'll understand in a minute that I'm going to use on my squeeze page. Okay, so straight away. Uh, you can see that the they've got an attention grabbing headline there um, so why create one yourself when it's already done and by the way guys don't worry about copying stuff off these sales pages just remind yourself what you're doing you as an affiliate are going to be promoting this product for the people who have either designed or had this wet this sales page designed so that believe me they're not going to have a problem with you copying some of their headlines or some of their text okay to use to try and sell their product okay um now so the astonishing life-changing secrets of the most successful happiest richest people in the world uh, is a headline that i want plus the, the sub headline below which is learn how to make 2000 years the best year ever now so i want to copy that but i suspect that that's probably all part of this instance it's all part of one image this, so i might not be able to let's see what happens if i right click yeah as well as a thought it only let me save the image which is not what I want okay I want to just save the text so what I'm going to do I'm going to pause the video and I'm going to type out that text into my notepad and then we'll come back to it okay so uh, just bear with me uh, while I just do that guys and I'll see you in a second okay so we're back in my Aweber account now um, and I apologize for the screen being so small guys but there's obviously lots of information in here that I, that I can't really make public in terms you know due, due to data protection and all that sort of stuff so I'm just gonna have this top bit at the moment just to show you how you um, begin the, the web form creation process and that starts with creating a new list okay so that's easy to do, to do in Aweber I'm just going to click on create and manage lists so let's do that okay again you can see where that's taking me to here um, what I'm going to do next is simply click on this button here which is create a new list so let's do that so let's get on with it then uh, you can see where we are now um, it's taken us to a page where we, we just need to put in some basic information regarding that list you can see here that Aweber give it a default name which we're going to change um, so that's no issue so we'll start off by giving this list a new name um, we're going to be promoting the Mind Secrets Exposed product um, so I might just call this Exposed and see what happens already in use you can see what Aweber are doing so let's call it exposed so well, that's alright exposed that'll do um, mind secrets exposed can be the I can't even spell okay and that's me contact address you need to put a contact address in um, with a web so let's just that's my address there let's put that in uh, paste okay and then down to the bottom not got bother about notifications I'm gonna I'll put I'll do that anyway because you do need to do that at some point so there we are uh, and next thing we do save settings before we move on to the next stage okay it says successfully st save there so so we've done that now what we want to do is um, if we go to sign up forms we should be able to, to create that right now so let's click on that create your first sign up form and here we are this is where we're going to create our web form okay which is going to become our squeeze page now hopefully you'll see that this is not difficult okay the first thing you can see there is the the template that Aweber provide for you there's lots my suggestion right now at this stage would be to obviously use this blank one because 
we're going to be making so many changes to it then um, it's not going to look anything like this so it doesn't really matter to be fair but the first thing you want to do because we're going to use this as a squeeze page not just a web form we want to make it as big as we possibly can by dragging that resize arrow across and across and across okay so that's as big as we can make it right now uh, first thing we're going to do is edit the header okay so let's I'll move that down a little bit so you can see what I'm doing so let's click on that and you can see what that's going to do now okay the first thing I'm going to do uh, is add that remember the text we talked about earlier so let's get that notepad up there it is so I'm going to put that in there we we'll copy that stick it in there let's center that uh, I want a bit bigger than that don't I? I want that's at the moment I'm gonna put that on to 24 let's bring it a bit closer together okay as long as in life changes you get the most successful Okay, I want that to be bold as well, by the way. Uh, bold is better. I don't know what's going on here, why that didn't go bold, but there we are, let's do that as well. Okay, so that you can see it's populated already and over to the right there. You can see as you as you type it in, uh, you can see that it's already populated, so you can see what it looks like as you do it, which is obviously quite good. Um, so let's save that okay now the other thing we want to do because we're on on the header we want to change the background because remember I said that the uh, actually I'm going to do the text first okay let's change the text because the text is important it's going to be yellow text and there's going to be a reason for that okay I'm gonna change the background now and I'm gonna make the background red okay yellow on red is a good it's good to grab attention so you can see there okay so that's that's the that's the header um, now if we go to uh, I don't want to do that yet actually the submit button no I don't I don't want to do the submit button yet so uh, let's do the uh, body okay we want to add text to the body now because I want to add uh, text element the text elements I want to put the rest of that headline in that I had that subheader I'm going to do that copy that put that in there paste okay I want to make that bold I want to make it bigger than that. I want to make that 18. Uh, we're going to center it. And I'm going to leave it at that for the moment and see where it is. Let me just check that. There it is. So I, I want to move that now because I want that there. Okay. But what we want to do is make that. I want that red because it'll look better. So let's make that red. Save. Okay. Learn how to make your 2013 your best year ever, regardless of where you are right now. Okay. Now let's go back to the Mind Secrets Exposed page. Okay. I want to maybe use some more of the. I like that. let's see what we've got there's lots of stuff on here that we could probably use um, I just want to add some more to that text element uh, what if you or what if all you need is that one big break in life the art and science I could use that actually I suppose let's see mind seekers exposed to the art and science of getting what you want no I don't want to use that uh, Let's keep going. Click here for Mind Seekers Expert. Click here for instance access. Uh, 
this this can be a little bit time consuming but of course it's important to get this right because obviously you're going to be using this to, to build your list so you want you want people to be attracted with it and buy it um, so it's important that you do this properly okay uh, you know, imagine having the ability to generate cash I like that at the flick of a switch Starting license, you know, it's maybe the most important. You know, so you might want to pay. Let's say uh, you learn secrets from success, whatever, you know, whatever you put to mind. You want to do secrets, you know, to me. So we don't want too much on this. Um, let me pause. I'm going to pause this and come back to it. Okay, let's pause it. Okay, we're back again, and you can see here I've got uh, some more text to add in there. Enter your name and primary email address below, and you'll have instant access to the same covert techniques that the rich and successful have been using for years. I like that, so I'm going to go back to the sign up form. Um, edit. I'm going to edit the text. Okay. Let's go underneath that a little bit further, and then we'll add that in copy paste it's important that you understand that you um, what you have to do with people is basically tell them what to do so that's pretty much what I'm doing with that extra bit of text I've put in there let's save it I'm telling people to enter their name and email primary email address below and you'll have instant access to the same so you can see what I'm doing there um, I'm telling people to enter their obviously their name and email address so that's what you want to do I want to put that in a di slightly different colour just to make it stand out so I'm going to make that green that bit ok let's see what that looks like no don't like that let's, end, let's change that again then so um, it might look better black actually so let's just make it black and bold and see what happens I don't know why it's, it's not doing all of it oh sorry this is sometimes this happens now it's not bold <laughs> Okay, let's see what that looks like. Enter your name and primary email address below, and you'll have instant access to the same covert techniques that the written successful have been using for years. Okay, I don't know why that is. What's happened to that? There. That needs to be bigger. That needs to be 24. Save it. Okay, so there we we've got that bit now. That's good. So we've now got the headline: the astonishing life-changing secrets of the most successful, happiest, and richest people in the world. We've got a sub-headline that says: Learn how to make 2008 your best year ever because of where you are right now. Enter your name and primary email address below, and you will have instant access to the same covert techniques that the rich and successful have been using for years. Okay, so I'm going to move on to the next element now which is the submit button so if you bear with me we'll we'll get straight on to that okay submit button is what we're going to do so uh, you can see the submit button right there we obviously don't want that um, the first thing you want to do is actually censor it to be fair so if you just click on it it's a submit button there I'm going to click on that button there which will put it in the center there you are you can see that in the submit now that's going to ch allow us to change the text okay now again we don't want submit on there we want some other text so I'm going to go back to the mind secrets exposed again 
and I'm going to make use of um, some of their text. So I'm going to go straight down to the bottom because I spotted it before. Um, that's a, that's the one there. Click for instant access. I think is is probably the best thing to have. Click for instant access. Sounds good to me. So let's go to my uh, back to the sign up form. Click on submit. Okay, I'm going to put on there. Click for instant access. Click. I'm going. In fact, I'm going to say sorry. Click now for keep getting this wrong with caps now for instant access okay so that'll do click now for instant access right so we what we want to do with that again um, we want to change the background, so we're on. So we're on the submit button, as you can see there. Submit button. Um, that's the background colour. Uh, commonly for buttons like that, yellow is a is a good background colour to have. So let's make it yellow. Uh, we want a proper yellow, not not some horrible yellow. Uh, where's the yellow? Yellow. yellow. Okay, let's have a look see what that looks like. Okay, and then we want... I don't really like that. I'm going to make that a better yellow. Is it that one? Okay, let's, what does that look like? Yeah, that's not bad. And um, obviously, we want to change the text, so we're still on the submit button. Um, the font size we could do, we could probably make that bigger. Actually, let's make that. Yeah, that's better. In fact, I'm going to go bigger again. Actually, I'm going to go to 24 and see what that looks like. Click now for it. That's much better. Okay, so what we want to do now is is the text color. And again, uh, commonly blue on yellow. Oh, I don't know why that hasn't changed. Uh, blue, I didn't click OK, I guess. Let's click OK. It's still not changing. Text color. That's why. Okay, let's see what that does. There we are, that looks much better. Click now for instant access, okay? So that's gonna get that's that's a nice big button that's quite obvious what we want people to do. Click now for instant access. Okay, so anything in primary image and you'll have instant access to the same cover and, and that carries on, that message carries on with the click now for instant access that we've said there okay now I'm gonna remove that email privacy bit I'm gonna move remove that email marketing okay what you wanna do now the footer okay we're gonna edit the footer and we're gonna edit that with an image okay now I'll tell you that what I did earlier there's an image on the sales page here for Mind Seekers Exposed uh, that I'm going to use. It's somewhere... That image there, Mind Seekers Exposed image, okay? Um, I'm going to use that and the way we do it is by clicking on that I can copy the image URL, okay? Let's go back to our sign up, sign up form click on image uh, we can move that to wherever we want the URL uh, position it in the center 
if we do this watch what happens this is magical there we are look at that so now we've got that lovely graphic down there okay so this is almost complete now guys we've got the headline which is the astonishing life changing seekers are the most successful happiest richest people in the world we've got the sub headline which is that bit there learn how to make and then enter your name prompt and then click now for instant access so all the elements of a squeeze page are there okay so the next thing we need to go on to is to go to step two as it says down there um, I probably need to add a we can edit the footer by saying something like um, we I'm just going to add in a quick disclaimer we value your privacy just as much as you do your details Ooh. your I can't spell today, I don't know what's going on with it. your details will not be shared okay let's put that in we'll make that okay we value privacy just as much your details will not be shared so that's important to have that in there okay so i'm going to save that and then we'll move on to step two okay we'll save the form okay you can see what it says there your web form has been saved so the next stage now is to go on to step two which is what it's telling us down there so let's do that uh, we need to give this web form a name so we can call it the same we can it, don't forget we're doing mind secrets exposed so let's just call it mind secrets okay we don't want not bother about Facebook the thank the thank you page this is where it now becomes important for you to take notes okay uh, the thank you page is do you remember the hop link we talked about before okay well that's the, that's where you want to send that's where you want to send your um, subscribers okay um, so see where it says thank you page you click on that arrow okay custom page your own URL now this is where your hop link is going to go into so let's go to my See, I'm going to paste, copy this one here. Copy. Okay, let's stick it in there. Paste. We make sure you don't double up there. Okay, just got to make sure of that. Uh, and it will give you the option to open this in a new window, which is what you want. Um, let me just check that a minute. I don't know why it's put, it's put two. So I want to get rid of one of them as well and that P I don't know where that P has come from but let's get rid of that okay so that's that's where I want you need to check that and make sure that's right so let's preview it make sure it's the, yeah and there we go so we know it's the right page so we leave the page okay so that's right so all of these have tried page doesn't matter so the next thing we need to do is go to step three so let's do that right now step three okay save it okay now this this again this bit is quite important this is the asking you who's going to publish the form okay now you don't want to do it if this is purely a squeeze page that you're using within your Aweber account so you want Aweber to host the form okay so what you do, you click on this, and that is the link to your web form. Okay, so let's preview it, and hopefully, fingers crossed, it will show our web form as a squeeze page. And there it is. Look at that, guys. There's your squeeze page. That's the squeeze page that we created. Okay, it's called Mind Secrets. 
and that's where I'm going to send people. Okay, so let's close that. So that code, that website address there, I'm going to copy that. I'm going to stick that into my notepad again. Again, this is quite important that you do this. So that's going to stay there because that's the, that's that uh, URL there is the URL that you're going to use to promote that. Okay, so so pretty much that bit is done. Okay, so you've created your web form. Uh, Aweber are going to host it there. That's pretty much done. Okay, so from an Aweber point of view, um, that's the last of the Aweber bit that we need to do. We're gonna what we're going to do now is going to show you how you can immediately start to promote that using free marketing methods. Okay, so let me just quickly. Uh, move on over I'm going to go to Twitter first but first of all we're going to shorten the link okay so bear with me you understand what I mean by that okay we're here at bitly.com uh, bitly.com is a um, free service that will allow you to shorten any links because obviously we we've got the let me just open up notepad we've got these links here we've got the hop link and we've got the Aweber forms and you can see that they're, they're quite a, a cumbersome and ugly looking URL so you don't really want to be promoting those so what we're going to do we're going to shorten this this link here which is the link to your squeeze page and it's quite simple with with bitly.com very easy see what it says paste link here that's exactly what I'm going to do okay now it's going to allow me that that's the link they've they've uh, given me so I'm going to copy that and we're going to open up here and we're going to put it in here so this link now is the link that link is the short link for that URL which is the URL to our squeeze page okay so I've done that you can see it already says in there mind secret so so that that's that's there um, so that's what you do with bitly okay so um, that link now what we can do is test it first of all to make sure that the link works and goes to our squeeze page before we start a promotion so that's what we're going to do next so let's do it okay we're on a Google search page now um, because this is the bit where we're going to test the links that we produce to make sure that everything works so the first thing I'm going to do I'm going to type in or I'm going to place copy in, and uh, paste the short link that we created with bitly and that should take us to our squeeze page so let's give it a go and there we are so there's our squeeze page so that works so you can see how easy that is to do uh, what I'm going to do now is test it so I need to put my name in here okay and my email address which is there and this should now take us to the sales page yeah so that's working so let, let's wait for the video to start and I'll pause it hi Greg Fry okay now what we want to do here instant access okay now you can see let me just double check with you there I'm gonna show you something that's my Clickbank nickname up there okay so you need to make sure when you've you've gone through the process of sign of signing up on your own web form ie squeeze page that in the URL bar at the top is your hop link okay so that's there so that's worked so far what I'm going to do now is going to, I'm not going to obviously buy this through the, at the moment, uh, but I'm going to click on instant access, which will take me to the order page. Okay, now let's scroll down to the bottom and you can't see that, can you? Let's move that down. There we are. You can see that at the bottom, again, there is my Clickbank affiliate nickname. Okay so that's great stuff all the links work so that's that that process out of the way the next thing we're going to do 
is we're going to go to Twitter and we're going to show you how you can immediately start to drive traffic to that squeeze base. Now you know all the links work, everything's live. You can now begin the process of driving traffic. So we'll head on over to uh, Twitter and we'll start start the ball rolling with that. Okay, well here we are in one of my Twitter accounts, and I'm briefly gonna all I'm gonna show you here is I'm gonna create a new tweet uh, and immediately start to promote that um, that link. Okay, so compose new tweet. Let's go here. Uh, I'm gonna simply I've got all, I'm all gonna, already gonna use that text there. Look, see, learn how to make two the best you ever. It doesn't where you are right now, so we we'll make the most make the most of the of the the text that we've already used. To post, Paste that in there. Click here. Okay, and then let's po let's go back. Copy that. That's the link we want to we want to promote in there. Put that on there. And easy enough to do, guys. Tweet, send it, and there, there you go. It's appeared there, so you can see straight away. And again, we know that they work. We know that that that, that works. So that is immediately tweet. That's going to hopefully bring some people to click on that link, and they're going to go to that squeeze page. So, so that's the process, guys. Um, uh, hopefully, you can see that it's not really difficult. It can be a little bit fiddly. But I'll tell you what, you do that a couple of times and, you, and you, you, each time you do it, you get quicker and quicker and quicker and you can get more creative with, with the uh, web form stroke squeeze pages that you create. And the beauty of it is, obviously you can create as many of them as you possibly want to promote as many products as you want. So if you do that right now, you can begin to start building your list today. Okay, so... I appreciate you watching this video. I hope you've gained something from it. Please click on the link below to find out more about me. Um, you can go to workwithjohnlooty.com or whoisjohnlooty.com. Find out more about me and look at some of the systems and, and the other trainings that we provide. Whatever you decide to do, guys, if you're going to follow a system, whatever you're going to do, please take action. And above everything else, enjoy what you're doing. This is John Lutie saying thanks guys and I hope to see you on another training video very soon. Cheers.